Good morning. Welcome to Wednesday. It's October 21st, 2020. We're going to go ahead and get our daily message today. I hope everyone's doing well. Um, I hope you're um, dealing with all the energy in a positive light. Um, because sometimes it can be very difficult. So we get like focused on the difficulties and the challenges and we don't want to work through them. So it's always important to work through them. If something's coming up, to be aware of what it is, acknowledge it, and find out why you're being triggered by that issue because that's why it's being brought up so you can figure out why it's a trigger for you and you can work through it and heal whatever that was that caused that to be triggered. So let's go ahead and enter our message. Whoops, I'm just fumbling the cards already. <laughs> let's go ahead. I'm going to be using the Sacred Spirit reading cards today to get our message. So let's go ahead. And I think I'm going to go ahead and get one of those wild offering just to add to it again today. So I got um, my deck right here to pull off of. So Let's go ahead. Spirit, what, what do you want the collective to know today? Or whenever they come across this reading, what is the um, focus for today? Or, like I said, when anybody comes across this, these messages are always timeless, so if you come across them a different date, um, you're meant to hear them. So, let's go ahead. Okay, today is October 21st, but if you come across this January 3rd, that's when you're supposed to hear the message. Spirit leads you places that you need to be um, to acknowledge things to heal and grow to the higher self. So, what is our message today, Holy Spirit? What is our message? All right. Okay, Spirit. What's our message, please, for the collective? What's the message? Okay. So, the message today is mindful wisdom. Create inner harmony. Look at that beautiful owl. I mean, the colors are beautiful. So this is number 28, which breaks down to an 11. The magic number, right? All right, 28. Okay, mindful wisdom. Mindful wisdom. Create inner harmony. Silence your inner critic. Mindfulness is the simple act of being present in each moment, but it, for most people, it is not always achievable during daily life. Complications of employment, relationships, children, social activities, and career choices can all seem to distract us from achieving this goal. It is only when you choose to become present that you receive clarity of consciousness, peace of mind, and objective understanding surrounding current issues. Well, let me tell you, um, not to bring up my own thing, but this is kind of like how I relate to it. After like going through an emotional turmoil of getting my house together and moving out and leaving behind like those memories, um, going through every little piece of paper and project that everyone did and things I had collected up over the years and memories from my past, packing all that up, leaving the house in general and driving so far is completely exhausting. So I can see where you can get bogged down and fogged where you can't. Um, have that mindful wisdom. It's very difficult with the life channel. Then you have like, you know, work telling you you need fingerprints and this and this. There's always all these different directions pulling you, but it's always important to take that few minutes you can. If you ever hear that quote, it says, meditate 20 minutes a day, and if you don't have time, meditate an hour. <laughs> yeah, it's like that. So let's go ahead and get back into this message. So. The owl is a rep representation of inner knowing and mindfulness, patiently and carefully monitoring their surroundings, followed by clear and direct action. Oh, and also, believe it or not, we stopped at a, um, a little side place on our trip, and um, up in the corner, there's this little owl just sitting there observing everything. It's just looking around, just chilling, you know? And it's funny how their little heads move, but he was just like taking in all the sights um, observing everything going on. It was interesting. You may feel, be feeling confused about people's actions, but like the owl, we must observe our surroundings to the best of our ability to see the real meaning of a person's actions or their origin, origin of specific issues. Now is the time to journey inwards to access your inner knowing and personal wisdom through mindful practice to create a homostasis and equilibrium in your heart and mind. Bring yourself back to a heart space where you can approach anything with calmness and clarity. Right now, place yourself of value. Sorry about that. My, note, my lip was itching. 
Right now, place yourself of value. When the hour appears in your life, it encourages you to use strong intuition to gain wisdom about matters that you shouldn't ignore. More importantly, self-worth and confidence. Tolerance can be achieved through objectivity and inner peace. Acknowledging all your experiences so you can be objective with your emotional and mental processes. Instead of reacting immediately out of anger, mindfulness allows you to be aware of this anger helping you to realize why you are angry and then process the circumstances surrounding this emotion. This new form of emotional intelligence allows you to physically react using a positive process and method that is beneficial to you and others while understanding the reasoning behind your behaviors. The shadow aspect is stubbornness, impatience, forgetfulness, and thoughtlessness. Sacred crystal is karaite and angel assistance is archangel to Zadkiel, forgiveness is releasing judgment and painful memories, and your affirmation is, I react sensitivity, sensitively to others as I respect my personal boundaries. So, I react sensitively to others as I respect my personal boundary, boundaries. So, that's your message. Sorry, I got a little tongue tied there. I guess my throat chakra is still going crazy. And I swear, you ever hear that little um, myth where people are talking about you if your nose is itching? The past few days, I don't know, maybe people were saying, that girl's crazy because she moved all the way across the country. <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, yeah, it's just been like itching like crazy. Anyway, your message today is to take time out to focus on mindfulness, to have that peace and inner, thing, inner uh, energy. Don't react to the first emotions you feel. Take some time out to observe and see things from a different perspective and get your um, mind and heart in alignment before you react, which is easy to do. So that's a message from Spirit. So let's go ahead and see what the other card is. And it is forgiveness. Healing comes from acceptance. Help me, dear Lord, to fully accept what is knowing that all this alone will open me to the new. Yeah, forgive yourself, forgive others, and move forward practice that mindfulness so that's your message today i hope you have a beautiful day take care bye